Whether it's more important to coach or to win is something people always talk about when you're winning. When you lose, then people start talking about other things and start to criticize. We know that we need to bring up players, that's our responsibility, but we also have to respect the role of the club that we're working for and its qualities and its levels of demands mean that we have to compete and to aspire to win games. And if we do win, there's another concept, and that's knowing how to win. Not winning any way, but also respecting the style of the club and the way that we coach players. That's an important target. But the ultimate target is always to try to win. Since the start of this year, things have been very difficult. A unique situation that's not happened in the history of the club, or I don't think in any other club in the world. It's something we'd never had to deal before, not just in a sporting sense, although obviously that has been difficult because we've been missing some 20 players. Others have had to go out of the club. But the real problem was the human problem, having the children here asking us why they couldn't play, asking what they'd done wrong. That was really difficult. Sometimes we didn't have the answers ourselves. It's been a very difficult time, but we've managed to stay strong and overcome those difficulties, and the academy at the club has never been stronger. We've continued to compete very well at every age level, and I think that we're very privileged to have such a strong youth structure at this club. I've done practically everything at this club, and this new stage is wonderful for the team, it's fantastic what's happening, and for a football person, this is about the nicest job you could possibly hope to have, but also there's a lot of responsibility. The academy is an asset that the club values very highly and we're always working to try to improve things and I'm very happy with the progress that we're making. I've been working with the boys for 17 years and I'm very happy with those years and now I'm working with women's football. Things are being done very well. The future of women's football in this country is very, very strong and there's still room for very much improvement. And I think that having such a strong structure around the men's football here, it's wonderful to be transferring that into the women's football.